Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we're doing a bit of a vlog. Um, me and the mister are travelling down up wherever to Edinburgh for the weekend so I thought it'd be a good time to pick up the camera and take you guys along with me. So at the moment I am literally just getting myself together, packing my stuff because as, as always I always leave everything to the last bloody one minute so I'm just everything's more or less at the door waiting for him to come and collect me. So I, I thought I'd just jump on and kind of introduce and let you know what's going to be happening in the vlog. So I'm going to crack on with what I need to do um, and then I'll pick up the camera on the way down and then I'll show you around the Airbnb that we're going to be staying at as well. Um, so if this is your first time visiting my channel, hello and welcome. Thank you. Please do make sure you hit the subscribe button if you are interested in videos on fashion, beauty and lifestyle kind of content um, and also please make sure you hit the notification bell that will let you know when i uploaded a new video and then also please make sure you hit the thumbs up and that will also help my channel so with all that being said i'm going to crack on with the rest of the bits and bobs that i need to do and i'll speak to you guys a little bit later on <laughs> Coffee break, coffee break. Right, so we are on stop number, stop number two, two hours away. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'll get there at some point this week. But it's it's far from Manchester. What, four hours is it? For you, four and a half hours, yeah. Yeah, four and a half hours, so we're halfway there. So I'm, I'm having my um, Costa coffee. No advertisement here, but you know, just having a little coffee. Um, so yeah halfway there and um maybe when i get there i'll check in and say hi because we're doing a nice little tour i'm gonna do a tour of the um, airbnb so hopefully it's not a shit hole but we'll see <laughs> we'll see when we get there <laughs> see you in a bit made it in one piece uh, so we've just entered the airbnb and it's uh, we were pleasantly surprised it's really nice um so i'm gonna give you a quick tour we've not brought anything in from the car wash yet so i'll give you a quick tour um really cute not really nice pleasantly surprised so anyway i'm gonna flip you around and then i'll show you what it looks like before we make a mess of it so this is the entrance uh, so it's quite a small entrance there's the the front door um as you come in and as you come in you've got your little coat stands and like little pictures and stuff um and then you have this little bench i've just plonked my bag on there um and then you've just got like some artwork on the wall so it's quite close so apologies i can't get any further away really and then you come down the hall and the bedroom let's see ah there we go the bedroom is downstairs so this is the bedroom cute enough um there we go. Well, it's just got like a little thing with you again. Um, and then you've got some, oh, I didn't even notice that before. Some drawers, and then there's a little mirror there. Um, what's in this? Oh, extra blankets and stuff, which is nice. You can see that, extra blankets. Love the chest, it's clearly, clearly an old piece, but 
beautiful all the same could do with a little bit of work but hey ho and then here we have oh you can't actually you can't get in there <laughs> we tried that before so we'll just go around this way and then we have the um let's see if add, is your light on in here hopefully this is yep so this is like this is the bathroom very nice pleasantly surprised um, i think they've done it up really really well so there i am hello hello um so yes that's the bathroom a bit good at that well, actually i was going to bring one of the bath bombs but i suppose there's no bath song to the job i did forget one um and then obviously then we've just got the the sink and stuff and then you've got like a little cupboard down there um so yeah it's it's really nice is this one of them I thought this might be one of them touch mirrors, <laughs> you know, when you touch it and it brings light, but well, the light is pretty good. I should be alright doing my um, makeup in here. So yeah, pleasant, pleasantly surprised. Um, so we'll come out of the bathroom now, turn that light off, saving energy. And as you can see, this is just the hallway again. Um, and then I think in here, ah yeah, um, Paul's asking if they have a hoover and stuff so yeah we've got an iron board and everything in here which is great do we have an iron actually we've got an iron board ah yeah iron so it's got some facilities here for cleaning up um and all the rest of it which is really good and then oh gosh it looks like they've got some decent paint on there farrow farrow what's it farrow and ball paint so maybe that's what some of this and all the rest of it is but okay all right all right then i see i see you as they say or they like to say so I'll take you upstairs. Now upstairs is the living space. So yeah, so we have here. And then in here, we have a upstairs toilet, which I think is really nice. So you don't have to travel go all the way downstairs to go to the, to the bathroom. So that's lovely there. And then the kitchen um, is it's just, it's quite small, but I feel like it's laid out really well. So as you can see, so in here we have the, uh, what's it called, fridge, fridge fees and stuff. Then we've obviously got the stuff at the bottom. We've got a washing machine. Um, I love this sink because I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be doing my kitchen up at some stage, and I have kind of wondered what a black sink would look like, and I really like this. I like the finish on it, so it's not actual, you know, flat black, flat black. Um, and then obviously we've got electric hob i'm not keen on an electric hob but it's not my house so i don't, I don't really need to be bothered by that and i'm assuming that's one of these convection things uh, oh we've got like coffee machine toaster we've got some bits and bobs down there for us to use and then like the nice little seating area which is nice as well um, and then into the living area so i mean it's not my style it's not something i'd have but it's nice it would be nice if it was like an actual sofa because we could actually sit together have an evening would be nice but it is really nice, really well um, done, I would say. And then obviously the TV there, and then they've got like lots of little um, like knickknacks and things. So here, uh, that's a cute little elephant. And then obviously they've just got some stuff on on display. So all in all, um, I will say I am very pleasantly surprised. I'm happy with the place and I think if we can you know this is somewhere that we probably want to come back to hopefully um so definitely so yeah so um that is that um I'm probably gonna call it a, a night for today because I think it's about seven o'clock now so we've been driving since about do you want to say half one one o'clock so we've been driving for a while we stopped a few times so um because we traveled up with Paul's dog so I just wanted we had to stop a few times just obviously for for him to get out, for, sorry, for her to get out and kind of do a business and just kind of stretch her legs and stuff. So what we're going to do now is we're going to grab everything out of the car and then we're probably going to try and have a little mooch around, see if we can find somewhere to have something to eat. I might throw a few clips in, um, depending on where we find, if I can be bothered. If not, I'll pick up in the morning and kind of take you on our day and what we get up to. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. Um, yeah, so day two in Edinburgh. So I've um, popped a bit of bit of what the, <laughs> tut, a bit of makeup on today. Nothing too crazy. I just thought I'd um, 
do a bit of brows, bit of concealer, try and look a little bit awake. Um, didn't sleep too great last night, not terrible, but I find it always difficult to um, sleep like a first night in somewhere different. So, um, so we're just gonna go out for a little mooch on the high street. Um, and then we're heading out to meet a few friends later on today, this evening. So we're gonna try and get as much done before we have to meet them. I think it's around six, seven o'clock. Um, so what time is it now? I think it's around 10 o'clock-ish now, 10 a.m., something like that. So we're going to go out, have a little wander around, then go into this um, city centre, uh, have a look around through the shops, and then head back, get changed, and then head back out again. So I will take you along with me during today. And yeah, that's pretty much it for the moment. I will get a little outfit shot. I'll ask the mister just to kind of show what I'm, what I'm wearing. I've pretty much just back on what I had on yesterday considering we literally, I literally drove up in it and kind of that that was it so I did try to not pack too much stuff because I didn't want to have to carry loads of things so um, we're only here for th three nights yeah three nights so I didn't feel the need to carry too much so yeah I will pick you back up shortly yeah oh okay and um, so uh, outfit today I've got my uh Louis Vuitton puzzle bag uh, and then I'm rocking my, I think, is it, I'm, I can never say the name, An Anya Bing sweater, what have you, I've done a poll on this, so I'll link that as well in the video so you can have gander. And then I've got my Abercrombie jeans, and then I have my trusty faithful um, Converse, which are mega comfy, so perfect for walking up and around um, Glasgow, not Glasgow, God, I'm not even in Glasgow, Edinburgh, yeah, I used to work in Glasgow, that's why I say Glasgow. But yeah, so this is my outfit for today. I'm not too sure weather-wise, so I might throw on my leather jacket on the top of this. Not too sure yet. I'm going to step out and see how I feel. Uh, but outfit for today, so I will see you when I'm walking around the city of Edinburgh. <laughs>
um, a half log of what I'm Yeah, yeah, yeah. Local yeah. one, 4.1 cents. Yeah, that's all. Right. And yeah. can I have uh, the parter? Thank you, the parter. No worries. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah, so we're having half a... Can you zoom it? I mean, frame. Oh, look at that. You can do it. Give them a recorder. So we're in a local... What's it called again? Stockbridge Tap. Stop. Stockbridge. <laughs> Stockbridge Pub. <laughs> tap. <laughs> yeah, we're in Stockbridge Tap. I mean, I'm not good. <laughs> We've walked all the way to the town centre and then we're now stopping for a quick drink. What time is it now? It's about one o'clock, did we say? Two, one o'clock ish? Yeah, it's about that. Quarter to two. Half one. It's half one. So we're gonna have a quick drink, get the energy up, and then um, head back and take the doggy for a walk, and then yeah, chill out. Oh, I don't know. I did try and spend some money, but Paul wouldn't let me spend any money today. I saw the Montego boots that I wanted to buy, I saw the Wavy trainers that I wanted to buy, I saw the dress that I wanted to buy, and he wouldn't allow me to buy them. So I came. Uh, oh, I I did manage to pick up a room fragrance from where was it again? Don't tell me, don't tell me. The white definitely. So I managed to pick up a bit of room fragrance. So I'll show you guys that a little bit later. So that's all I bought, and I didn't even buy that. Paul bought that for me, so I've not spent any money, which is um, very strange. So I'm sure I'll get that rectified by the end of um, the, the trip. But yeah, so just like check in. So catch us in a bit. <sighs> good morning, good morning, or should I say good afternoon? Um, yeah, what time is it now? Ten, ten past one. Ten past one. Um, so we're heading to Porto Portobello Beach. Um, about 20, 20 minutes, 25 minutes away. So nice day. Um, it, it, I think initially the weather was supposed, it said it was supposed to rain today and was supposed to be dry yesterday and it was the opposite. So it rained a little bit yesterday and it's drier today. So sun's out. Seems really nice. So we're going to go there for a little bit and um, have a little bit of a wander and then just kind of see how the day kind of takes us a bit of a leisurely day today i think yesterday was it was a nice day but i felt like we kind of um we're like running around most of the day so it was knackered so we just want to try and take today and just kind of chill out and then um, just go to our own leisurely place this is our last full day and then we travel back tomorrow around i think 10 a.m or we have to check out about 10 a.m so so yeah so I will um, pick you guys up once I arrive and I hope everyone's doing okay and I hope you enjoy the vlog so far. I'm not, you know, a pro at this vlogging lot, but I'm trying so hopefully you're enjoying it. There's one. Yeah, there's, yeah, no, I said read it on it and it said you can bring dogs. It said dogs walking and all the rest of it. So, yeah. Ooh, Porter, Porter, Bello. Beach. <laughs> wow, busy day. <laughs> this camera's shy, so you don't want to be on video. But it's really nice. Really busy. You can see. Wow. It's massive. Oh my god, look how far it goes down. Wow. Oh, we're on the um, Porta, Portobello beach um really nice day paul doesn't want to speak he doesn't, he doesn't want to be um, heard in the background talking so yeah i thought i'd look to, i'll flip it around you can see said beach see it behind me there so nice really nice day i mean i still have my jacket on because i am me and i'm always cold so it's a little bit cooler by the seafront but it's really nice really nice peaceful so good shout for today i'm glad the weather's pretty decent so so yes so we're probably gonna just walk, try and get to the other end of the is it promenade that they call it pier whatever um get something to eat a little snack and then uh, see what the rest of the day holds for us so yeah enjoying edinburgh thus far Hello everyone, um, yes, so I am back, made it back home in one piece, both of us, um, in the rafts at home safely, and I'm now zoning out on the city, uh, so I thought I'd quickly just come on and um, end the vlog and just kind of, yeah, <sighs> yeah, I had a, a really good time, really good time in Edinburgh, 
I've been there a few times, um, work-wise and things like that, but this was the first time that we've had a actual Acapulco relaxing weekend. I really enjoyed it. It's somewhere that we would definitely go back. So, um, yeah, looking forward to that. So, again, as I say, I hope you've enjoyed the vlog. Uh, I am going to try and condense it down as, as much as I possibly can because there's a, 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 yeah, clips, 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 clips. So I will do my best to kind of, um, you know, make it as short as possible. But without missing any of the good bits. So if you did make it to the end, thank you. And um, please do make sure you hit the red subscribe button down below. And also whilst you're down there, please make sure you hit the notification bell. And that will let you know when I've uploaded a new video. And I think that is everything I wanted to say. So with that, I'm going to go and wait for something to eat. And then I'm going to probably try and get to bed early because I am exhausted. Um, but yeah, so I hope everyone's doing well and I will see you in my next video. See you later.